Happy Feral Friday. We're back with another Feral Friday vlog. You guys, last week on Friday, I just completely forgot about the Feral Friday vlog. So my apologies, but we are back today. I'm about to leave for the gym. And I think today I'm going to do, I've been getting so bored. That reminds me, guys, in my luteal phase, my cravings have been, the pa my past two cycles, I have had the most insane cravings the past like, or like the two weeks before my period. Like my period isn't even supposed to come for like 10 days and I've been like eating everything, like insatiable appetite. Anyway, so I'm gonna take my Lemmy Curb. This stuff is so good for period cravings. It like literally works so well. But I'm about to leave for the gym. And I think today I've been getting so bored of my walks. You guys know I've been walking like mostly like four miles. I've been doing four miles a day, which takes like a little bit over an hour. And it has just been so like tedious for me the past couple of days. Like I can't do it. So I'm like, you know what? Today I'm gonna do... I think I'm gonna do 30 minutes on the Stairmaster and then two miles on the treadmill, just to switch it up a little bit and also to, you know, get the glutes working, you know, get the glutes working a little bit, get those, keep those legs toned, you know what I'm saying? I haven't done the Stairmaster in a little bit. That used to be like my cardio of choice. Like I would do it like every single day, literally like, what, like seven years ago now? I can't believe those seven years ago, but I used to Stairmaster all the time. I had my protein shake with cinnamon and flaxseed in it because Louis Phase gotta get our flaxseed in. I started reading a new book. And I read like the first like 15 pages, maybe I'm reading tomorrow and tomorrow and tomorrow, I think is what it's called. But um, I, I'm literally only a, a chapter in, so I don't know how I feel about it yet, but that's my new book, but I'm not like super excited about it or anything. Also you guys, what I am excited about though, I did get, I, I just ordered some new furniture cause I've had like the same furniture since I was like, like 13 years old, like since like the seventh grade basically. And I finally got like a new bed. I've never had like a full bed frame before so I feel very very adult I put it together yesterday and it literally looks so beautiful but I need to I'll show you guys in a second but I am still waiting my nightstands are coming I've never had two nightstands before so again very adult I'm getting two nightstands um those are th coming I think tomorrow and then I have some throw pillows that are coming on Monday because I've never had throw pillows in my bed I just always had like my sleeping pillows never any like decorative pillows but it looks so cute obviously i'm still waiting on the throw pillows and the nightstands but i'm gonna show you guys my new bed because it's it like makes me so happy let's go look isn't she so gorgeous i'm gonna get two nightstands obviously for the sides and they're just like um like a light wood like pedestal style nightstand they're like circular on top so hopefully it'll look cute this blanket is like giving everything it just like all looks so good and then i got two tan like big euro pillows for the front of them and i'm hoping it won't be like too many like creams tans whites all mixed together but hopefully it'll be good but this is just from wayfair i've never bought anything from wayfair before but it literally came next day like it came the next day i was shocked and i love that everything matches my hatch alarm clock but yeah as you can see my nightstand look how messed up my nightstand is so embarrassing that lamp is literally from walmart i want to get new lamps too but i'm like girl like i can't be buying all this stuff all at the same time my credit card literally like emailed me and i was like is this a fraudulent charge and i'm like no i know girl i don't usually spend money like that but you know we're re we're redoing we're we're what's it called revamping the apartment this week also my comforter is i think from brook linen i have two comforters on my bed to make it like extra fluffy and then this blanket it's actually a weighted blanket from oh my god i don't remember they sent it to me where's the tag on this i can't find the tag i don't know where it's from and then these pillowcases these ones are from drowsy sleep co they're silk ones as you can tell they're like shiny and then this one is actually where's the little thing it's the slip dr dennis gross collab it's so nice and so beautiful and then i also got a shelf like an over the toilet shelf you know like those things it's like three shelves and it like goes around your toilet i got one of those for my bathroom because i just need more storage in there it's just awful in there it just looks so bad so i got that too and i'm also looking at artwork prints like i'm really just i don't know like i'm just in my redoing my apartment era so that's what we're doing but i literally am obsessed with my bed it's so beautiful and gorgeous i can't believe like i can't believe how pretty it looks and i haven't even gotten the nightstands and the pillows yet like it's only going to be prettier you know and then if i get new table lamps it'll be even more gorgeous but i don't know about those yet i still have to decide on those but and then i got my new desk for christmas you guys know i got that new desk it's just like looking really gorgeous and beautiful in here. So I love that. Anyways, I need to go to the gym. Um, I did weights yesterday. So not doing weights today. I did like some weights and then my ab workout. Um, so I'm just going to do the stair. Hopefully, you know, the stair. I'll probably be sore from that because I haven't done the Stairmaster in like probably like two months. So I'm definitely going to be sore from that. So I'm just going to do the Stairmaster and walk today and then probably my abs if I have enough energy too and then sauna of course oh you gotta do the sauna but and then of course we're going to whole foods later so we're super excited about that but let's go to the gym my outfit doesn't even you guys like 
I am, first of all, my old bed is like blocking my laundry area. So I can't do any laundry because my dad is coming tomorrow to pick, cause he has a truck to pick up my old bed. So like my old bed is like sitting right here, like in front of my laundry, like closet. So I can't do my laundry, but um, I, my, my workout outfit doesn't match. Like, like this is like, this like drives me insane, but honestly, like I covered it up pretty well, but I'm wearing these Navy Lulu leggings. And then I literally just put on, this is the only sports where I had clean. It's like dark green and black from Abercrombie, but then I put this tank top over it. So hopefully it matches and no one can tell. <sighs> Nothing I hate more than an unmatched outfit. Anyways, I'm so excited for my bathroom shelf to come in. Like it's really just, uh, it's gonna be so gorgeous in here. You guys know I'm a Libra. I used to wanna be an interior designer when I was a little kid. I actually met this girl at my cousin's birthday and she was an interior designer. And I've never met, she was like my age, and I've never met an interior designer before. So I was like asking her like a million questions about it. Like that's so cool. You guys, I forgot to film in the gym. That's so anti-girl boss of me, but I actually did more than I thought I was gonna do. I did the Stairmaster for 30 minutes and then I was gonna just walk two miles, but I ended up walking three miles. I was just feeling it today. And then I went to my app routine, period queen, and then I did the sauna. And now we're all done. We're going back, I'm drinking my protein shake with my flax seeds and I think I think I want a yogurt bowl I haven't had a oh no I haven't had a yogurt bowl I haven't had a yogurt bowl in a minute and since I'm craving like sweets I think that would be good because I could put honey peanut butter I've been putting my power crunch breaking up my power crunch protein bars and putting it in my yogurt bowls so good like unbelievably good so I think that's what I'm gonna have I should really have eggs I haven't had eggs and spinach and sausage chicken sausage in a minute but my cravings are speaking and I am answering no, my cravings are calling and I'm answering. So I think I'm gonna have a yogurt bowl. Oh, I'm salivating at the thought of it. Anyways, let's go home. Shower, skincare, breakfast, let's go. We're back, I showered, washed my hair today because it's Whole Foods Friday, gotta look good for Whole Foods. We're doing our red light mask, you guys, it's literally snowing out. Snowing, it's baseball opening day and it's snowing. Oh my God. I made my tea, spearmint, raspberry leaf, and um, dandelion root tea. Okay, red light mask is done. For skincare, of course, we're using Dr. Dennis, my favorite guy, the vitamin C serum. And then I let this dry for like a couple of minutes and then I'll put on my moisturizer. This is my favorite moisturizer ever. Peter Thomas Roth, water drench moisturizer. It's literally amazing, I love it. My period is coming up and I always get like a big giant zit before my period, so that's that here. But overall my skin, again, just been so good ever since I started drinking that damn tea. Who would've thought, who would've thought? It's literally been amazing. So I'm so, so grateful. I also just posted on my Instagram story for any like Pilates like class suggestions because I think I'm gonna make like a new routine for the next class that I do. Cause I've been doing the same routine I think the past like three or four classes. So I wanna like do a new one, an updated one for you guys. So I'm in the works of like planning that and seeing like what moves I wanna do and stuff like that. So I'm excited about that. I was brainstorming that on the treadmill this morning. Now let's make our yoga bowl. I don't have fake tan around and I literally can't even look at myself in the camera right now because I am so disturbingly pale. Anyways, taking some plain Greek yogurt. Let me show you guys the rundown of my yogurt bowls because they're delicious. So plain Greek yogurt. Honey, peanut butter from Trader Joe's. I've been, I think I might get almond butter or do almonds hurt my stomach. I don't know, I've been like in the mood for almond butter cause it's like a little bit different of like a texture. And I've been kind of like craving that lately. There new some chia seeds of course, cause luteal phase and omega threes and healthy fats, cinnamon, and then the peanut butter fudge power crunch bar. So freaking delicious in a yogurt bowl. I can't believe I invented this. I tried the strawberry one in a yogurt bowl, amazing. And then I have this, um, like the chocolate fudge, like the triple chocolate. Yeah, triple chocolate one, so good. If I had like strawberries or something, I would put that in there too, but I don't have any strawberries right now. I have oranges. I got oranges as my fruit of the week. I've been into like cutie oranges lately. I don't know, they're just so convenient and good. There she is, literally tastes like dessert, so good. Oh my God, you guys, I forgot to show you my whole foods off of the day, but I've already worn this one before. It's just a green sweater with my black low rise jeans and my green dunks, but we're off to Whole Foods now. I'm gonna film my vlog for TikTok, but I'll be back to show you guys a haul. Okay guys, I just finished filming for TikTok. I just got out of Whole Foods. I'm in the parking lot. I'm eating my chili lime cashews, my little treat of the week, but I did a different kind of video today. I like showed you guys like all the prices and like how much I realistically spend in a week at Whole Foods, which I thought was like kind of like a different concept than what I usually do, just like a little fun little vlog. So we gotta go home and edit that. I didn't even get any sweet treats. I didn't even get any ice cream, nothing. I've been having too many sweet treats this week. I had those chocolate covered bananas. I had the chocolate covered cherries and I had that whole entire thing of ice cream last week like I need to chill it with the with the sweet treats and my sister bought me these like cinnamon chips those siete cinnamon chips I ate the whole bag in a day yeah 
Yeah, I did. So we took a little day off from the sweet treats. We're having our cashews, but I'll show you guys a full haul when I get home. Okay, y'all, let's do a little haul. But first I got two packages and thank God I got this package. I've literally been dying for like the past five days without my, my caffeinated greens, which is my fault because I took too long to reorder them. But thank God my caffeinated greens came in because the, you guys know these are the best things that ever happened to me. So I got two packs of the, or I got three packs of the caffeinated and then I got some of the decaf ones cause I'm trying to, you know, control my caffeine and take a little bit. So maybe I can have a decaf one when I know that I'm gonna like have two coffees that day. You know what I mean? So I got a mix of both. So I got, oh, I'm so happy. It's been like a week without them. I miss them so much. Also they're doing a sale right now. Of course I freaking bought these before the sale, but it's 30% off with my code take crumbs. So if you want to try them, go go try them like go try them like it literally changed my life i drink so much less coffee now because i drink these instead and they're so delicious and i would never say that okay i am a coffee lover okay you guys know obviously and i've just been drinking so much less coffee because i have these now i'm obsessed with them anyways i'm so happy that these came in thank you jesus oh my god and then and then i got another pr package from actually this drink brand which i love a good bevy what the fuck i I'll actually probably have one of these tonight because of course I didn't get a sweet treat at Whole Foods. And of course, obviously I'm regretting that like so much. So these are actually, they DM me and they're sold at Whole Foods. I saw them there the other day, but they're called Half Day and they're like flavored iced teas, but they're like a, they're basically like a poppy, but it's iced tea instead of being like a soda replication. So there's raspberry iced tea, lemon iced tea, peach iced tea. And what's this one? regular just green tea so they sent me these so thank you so much to half day for sending these to me i'm very much looking forward to trying these out which one should i have first i feel like the raspberry you know what let's crack it open right now it's not cold though oh well i'm not really picky i love that they're sold in whole foods too that's such a sleigh by them oh my god this has eight grams of fiber in it holy shit black tea lemon juice raspberry hibiscus agave they're not sparkling so if you don't like the sparkliness of like poppy and stuff this might be a better option for you because it's not sparkling anyways now that we've unboxed my packages let's get into what i got at whole foods it was actually such a little baby haul today i got all my teas for my pimples we love that i got these i've been liking that you guys i got these randomly one week i already ate i ate half a bag in the parking lot but these snack lens they're like super low calorie they're really light and crispy and airy and they're sea salt and vinegar i love a sea salt and vinegar and I've been loving these, so I got those. And then I got these, which I also love the little um, chickpea crisp, rice, pea, and black bean crisps, actually, is what they're called. I got my chili lime cashews, which I devoured in the car. I got a big thing of Miss La Colombe. We got a coconut water. Got some bell peppers, because I'm back in my bell pepper sandwich era. I actually did a little recipe video with those on TikTok the other day and I made it with tuna as well instead of like a turkey sandwich and it was really delicious. So you can try that with tuna as well. Four lemons for my beverages, of course, my morning bevies. Dude, there were two poppies left on the shelf. That's it. They were on sale this week. So I got, this is the only thing they had left, strawberry lemon, which I don't know if I've tried before. And then orange, which isn't my favorite, but like whatever, like I'll still drink it. Then we got some strawberries for like my yogurt bowls and in the morning and stuff. And then a free Shavaka do. And that's all we got this week. Here's a little fridge haul for those interested. I'm literally so excited to drink one of these tomorrow. It's been a week without it. I literally, like when I wake up in the morning, I'm like, there's no point in getting up because like I don't even have my caffeinated greens. Like what's the point in getting up? Like it makes me not want to get out of bed because I didn't have these. Oh, I'm literally going to spring out of bed tomorrow. Thank you, Jesus. I got the juicy lime flavor, tangy toro and strawberry pineapple. Those are the flavors that I like. Oh, I had to change into my jammies. It's eight o'clock now. It's almost eight o'clock. It's 7.54. I'm gonna sit on the couch, edit and post my vlog on TikTok, and then probably edit this video, take off my makeup, and go to bed in my new Gorgina bed. And that's my Friday night, folks, and that's my feral Friday. The most feral I'm getting is the fact that I'm drinking this beverage that has eight grams of fiber in it. And I already had a poppy today. Am I gonna die?